Hey guys, and going back and doing research on the Kylie Rodney case and watching some old footage and things like that, I came across some comments on one of SOF's lives um, in the comment section that I want to share with you guys. Uh, this is probably going to be in two parts because it'll it's going to be pretty long, uh, but it's super interesting, uh, the things that are in here. And first, let me say this video, like all my videos, is only my opinion. It's only speculation. I'm not accusing anyone of anything and certainly not of any crimes. Please do your own research. Please form your own opinion and please show no hate to anyone, guys. Okay, so I came across this comment and I thought that was a really good comment. But as I kept reading, it gets more and more and more juicy. Okay, so this person is, their name is the Sheik Antique, I guess, or something. It's in numbers. Uh, and they say, here's my list that still bothers me regarding the Kylie Rodney case. Body was four inches shorter. Mm-hmm. Body was 15 pounds lighter. Mm-hmm. No dental records were used to identify the body. No birth certificate was found. The tattoo of 17 was in the wrong place instead of being on her ribs it was on her hip which I've always speculated in my opinion it sounds like someone was told on the phone she has a tattoo of 17 on her rib and I think someone heard hip instead of rib so um just my opinion okay so no water in the lungs well that's a big one isn't it because you, in order to drown, you have to have water in your lungs. The lungs were extremely small. Yes, they were. And Kylie was, yes, a singer. Mm -hmm. I don't think she would have the lungs of a two-year-old. But I'm no doctor. Mm. I don't agree with everything these people say. I'm just sharing it with you because this is, gets really interesting, I promise. Family and friends at Memorial, Memorial were smiling, all dressed up and taking pictures like they hit the lotto. Mother told us to get a new hobby. And I did. Um, 911 call claimed seeing a vehicle being pushed into a container prior to AWP finding her. Which is interesting because Tony Dodge went on and on and on and on and on about how her car could be in a trailer, in a car hauler. He did. Let me read that one again. That's a good one. Interesting. 911 call claimed to, of seeing a vehicle being pushed into a container prior to AWP finding her. The entire Nick AAA story, which is reconfirmed on Squirrel Girl's channel. Mm. Oh, we're going to talk about Squirrel Girl. Oh, yes, we are. But not right now. AWP told not to search where they found her. N numerous 911 calls, including one with a blonde in a blindfold. That came in prior to AWP finding her car. A blonde and a, light, a blindfold. Sammy and everyone else claimed Kylie was so wasted. And I guess Mrs. G does too, right? Mrs. G, who always tells us she doesn't speculate, who said that Kylie got wasted, basically, with Kate during that day. Hmm. Kylie was so wasted, yet toxicology proved otherwise. Mm-hmm. It sure did. The odd connection of Zanny, Tony, Mel, Ronnie, and others who all know each other, yet denied it and placed themselves into the narrative. Mm hmm. Yes, yes. I'm liking this she can, she can teaks opinion. <laughs> um. The, uh, the odds of a 16-year-old getting an IUD 
and the person said, I'm going to research this and see if I can find statistics. Why no creme brulee in the stomach? If she was making creme brulee, whether it was a drink, whether it was the real food, where is it? Where is it? Because they weren't making peas. So I heard, right? I heard they were making creme brulee. So number 18, why was Jagger in Kate's bed on 8 20 Mm hmm. Yes, why is that? Why is that, Jagger? Mm. Then this girl named Marlene says, I agree with all your question, questionable points. Regarding number 16, which is the one about the IUD, she says, or she, I guess she, um, in my area of Canada, IUDs are only given to women who have had at least one child and never a teenager. Yeah, that typically is the case. Could be different, I suppose, but that typically is the case. Someone named Lynn said, the creme brulee that was mentioned are creme brulee martinis prepped for the party, possible units to sell from the back of her car on the persistence of Meg. Meg. Let me read that again. The creme brulee that was mentioned are creme brulee martinis prep for the party, possible units to sell from the back of the car on persistence of Meg. Then the person goes on to say, Sammy did not allow that because she did the booze sales and they sold the batch to her and got a cut from the sales. Rumor has it allegedly. Then it has the recipe for the drink and it says, but where did they make these? At what house? Where was she until 930? Good question. From this location and house to the party site. Did something happen then? Or the night before on the way back from Reno? Hmm. And another incident, a female and a, ma a male found later dri driving on the road half an hour before coming home, driving home from the same car show and at a car show. You could switch cars. That's what they said. Now, I want to talk about a couple of things here. First of all, Meg. Did Megan Cole come out and say she's Megan Cole to cover for someone named Meg? Is Mags her best friend or was her best friend really Megs? Megs, Mags, it, you, if someone said it to you, it would be easy to confuse. Mags, Mags, right? So, I find this interesting and we're going to like these comments go on and again, Meg is mentioned, but I'm going to make a part two with that because it gets a little long, um, and involved, but I find it so interesting that the couple Juan Zavala and Jeanette Pantoja who went missing around the same, I believe it was the same day Kylie Rodney went missing. And then their bodies, from what I understand, were found burned beyond recognition outside of the vehicle. And the vehicle was not burned. Anybody else think that's weird? Because I definitely think that's weird. Very weird. And they also drove, if I remember correctly, a 2002 blue blue was a Ford Bronco I think blue a blue car but there's also other blue cars that are of interest in the next section we're going to go through um, that are interesting including and I quote Kylie's I'm sorry Nate the new lover so We'll be moving on to that next. Let me know what you guys think of this in the comments and I'll see you soon.